Well, hello friends, it's me, Debbie. And happy Mask Monday. This is gonna be the first Mask Monday I've been do I'm doing. And today I am gonna be using the Charcoal Detoxifying Face Mask. And I got this at um, the Dollar Tree. There was five in a box and they were $1.25 for all five of them. So, and I think at Walmart, they're like $1.99 to $2.49 for one. So $1.25 for five is pretty good. So, and I always keep mine, I have a makeup refrigerator that I keep my um, mask in and a lot of my skincare. But this one, and when, before I use them, I always put them in the freezer and then I get them out. They defrost pretty quick. And I have my hair up because I want to show you, I'm de, I'm going to, we're going to curl train my hair. We're going to get this mask on. Ooh, comes apart pretty easy. And it's um, infused with tomato extract. So since it does have, since it's been in the freezer, it's it's not going to freeze your face. It's not going to freeze at all, but I just like them cold. And there's times where I will take, I used to use rose water a lot. And I would put them in, I would put that in the refrigerator and ice cube trays and put that on my face. But I don't do that much anymore, but I will freeze some skincare. I'm going to put this on my face. Oh, that feels so good. And yes, I do have my gown on. Not doing anything today. Not feeling it. I may not even change out of my gown. Uh, if I do, I'll change into a pair of pajama pants. And a big comfy shirt. And that will be my day. Because we are going to curl train my, I want, I had somebody DM me and ask me how I curl trained my hair. So I did start a little bit of it because I usually do it in the shower. Because once I'm in the shower and I'm done, okay, we got this on. Now I don't put anything on my face when I do this. I just take and I make sure that it is damp. And when I come in, um, I don't put any actives on my face because this has got some stuff in it and I don't want um, it to, you know, because it could, if I put any actives like retinol or hyaluronic acid or anything like that on my face, it could um, irritate it. And there's usually quite a lot of serum in here in your bag. So I just like to take that. And I like to pour that on my hand. Mm. <laughs> that feels good. And then I do have, I love this stuff. Um, the Abla first spray serum. Now I will spray, I do spray this on, on top. I don't know why. It does not have any active in it. It's got truffle oil. It just feels good. Okay, now we are going to let that sit. We are going to let this sit for um, probably 10, 15 minutes. But when I curl train my hair, um, when I turn off the shower, because I don't... I'm not one that dries off with a towel. I do not, I never have. Um, and especially now since with my legs like they are, I do not, you know, I can't rub my legs. So I 
sit in the towel and while I'm air drying, I get deep conditioner and because you want your hair to be dripping wet. So I just stand in the shower Why I just, well, I have a shower chair that I sit in. So I just sit in my shower chair and I work on my hair. Let me do this here and I will show you. Ooh. So I don't feel so wet. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now, I either use, you can use any deep conditioner you want. I do have some can too that I use. And I do have some in here, if you can see. And I did start already on some. So. And if you have, if you have straight hair, but you have just a little bit of a curl, like just a little bit of a wave in your hair, if you do this with your hair, and it's, it, it's going to take a while. Now, if your hair starts getting dry, you can just, I use, I have a spray bottle that I would use a but if you can just use, um, you can do this with your hair. Now I take a little bit of the deep conditioner. Um, but you can do this. And your hair, you can train your hair to, to start getting some curls in it. But you just break it in two. Well, split it in two. And just crisscross applesauce. Now, I am the only... I mean, my, my mom and my grandma, they have... Well, my grandma had stick straight hair. My aunt's got... Hers is kind of curly. It's not as curly as mine. And neither is my mom's. My daughter, she's got a little, she had a little bit of way, but she done nothing but straighten hers um, all through high school because she didn't like the wave in her hair. So she doesn't have much wave anymore. Sometimes there's a little bit, but not much. Um, during, I, I did not embrace my curls until I was a lot older. Uh, so, but yeah, this is what I do, and I will show you, and if you have trouble with it coming apart, you can, um, take little rubber bands at the end. Okay, this has got some conditioner on it already. Yeah, wait a minute here. But this is what works for my hair. There's all there's all kinds of I've been doing this to my hair for years. And there's all kinds of ways that you can do it. You have to find out what really does work for your hair. This may not work for yours. And that's bothering my arm. Now, I don't have to do this to my hair all the time. I just do it when I deep condition. And here of lately, my hair has been very, very dry. So I've been doing this about once a week. Um, I also, I like using the Garnet. Um, I use the, what is it, Queen? Oh my gosh, I can't think of it now. But it's the cholesterol, I use that. I do not use coconut oil because it does nothing to my hair but make it dry. Because coconut oil actually does not penetrate your hair or your scalp, it just kind of coats it. And that's why you, and 
you just gotta detoxify your hair you gotta find a detoxifying shampoo and I don't like to use that on my head at all I use it every so often for build up but not very often I think it's detoxifying shampoo I do not like using it and you can make the braids as big or as little as you want I don't like to make them real big and I don't like to make them super small And then, I just got a couple more to put in my hair. But I will wear this all day, and I'll probably, I may even wear it all night. I've done that. I'll put it up in my silk bonnet and tie my shirt around it. Split this in two. But you gotta. Oops. That one's done. Is this here? Oh, this is it right here. I already did the back. I done that in the shower. Because. And then, yeah, just, then I'll show you how I put it up. Then I'll show you what I used for my, would get my eyelashes. Whoops, I got a piece. That one done, yep. Yeah. Everything done. Put it all back. Okay. I got my little silk bonnet. And I just tuck them all up in there. You gotta bend my head over upside down. Just a minute. Yeah, we had to bend upside down for it. Whew. And I got a t-shirt. This is what I use when I when I uh, fought my hair up on top of my head. Now, during that week when I don't do this, when I, I don't wash my hair every day either. But when I do, um, I do wet it every day. I do get in the shower and I what I do is I have to put, I put conditioner in it. I kind of like wash it with conditioner. And when I get out, I use, I do scrunch it after, cause I'll sit in the shower and that's when I put in my product. Why it is soaking wet, it is dripping wet is when I put in my, I put in my gel, my foam, my leave-in conditioner, my curling cream, I put all that in there. And then I use these, these are Diva, Gloves. I do not like Diva Curl. I that run my hair. I will not use it. it. Took me forever to get my hair back in shape. But that's up to you if you use it. But I do like these gloves. I had a friend send them to me. If you see them, I would not pay more than five dollars for them though. Um, the microfiber turbo towels work just as well. 
but I do like these. I don't put them on my hand. I just put them like this and I'll just kind of, you know, scrunch it because it's pretty useful to put them on your hands because they do get wet pretty quick. And I just, you know, kind of scrunch my hair up or, or use them both and just depending on how I want, as long as it's not dripping anymore once I put my head up. But, or I'll use this towel and I will stand up and show you. I take it, put it this way. Well, it's not a towel, it's a shirt. Cotton shirt. And when this mask goes off, I will tuck these under. But that is how I put this on my head and how I do my curl training. And I will sleep in this. Fix that better. I will probably uh, wear this all day and then sleep in it. this on my face and for my eyes this is just I got it at the Dollar Tree it is um, eye enhancer it's just castor oil that's all it is it's all you need to use on your eyelashes to help them grow and all you need to do is take these little I get these from Amazon they come in like a pack of I don't know a hundred or so for like six bucks and they just help condition and they do help them grow and also if you have trouble, if you don't have any, um, if you don't have any, uh, beauty balm to get your makeup off or any makeup remover, you can use that. Take a little bit and it will help. It will definitely take off any of your makeup, especially waterproof eyeliner and mascara i just dip a q-tip in and just take and put on it and rub it and it takes it right off now i'm going to take this mask oh and i'll rub all that in then take my willow my uh, nice cinnamide dab of that mm, feels so good my face feels really good. 
some hyaluronic acid. Some retinol today since I'm not going anywhere. And that just squirted all over me. That was good. this dry oh this feels so good feels so cooling you need to take care of your skin because if you don't take care of your skin your makeup doesn't look all that great you have to have good skin before you can have good makeup took me a while to really figure that out even though I've always done good I've always done good skincare my mom always did this is what my mom used, and I have the other thing. This is, I haven't used this. This is, I keep this. It reminds me of my mom. This is what was in her drawer, her bedside table. And I have another thing of it. This is what she used every night on her body. And then I've got a jar in beside my bed. I know, please don't say nothing <laughs> Um, and when I feel I'm sad, I, I, you know, I just take it and I can smell it. And I, it just reminds me of my mom. And this is old. My mom passed away in 2019. So, yeah. This and a big old tub of it. And she slathered it on her face and her body every single night. And she looked very good for, for her age. Now that that's dry, I'm just going to go in with my e.l.f. skin. And my keycap. And go in. My mom was a big believer in taking care of her skin. But the rest, whatever you don't use, put it on your arms, your legs, whatever. And that's it. That's my skincare. That's Mask Monday. That is my hair, my curl training. So, you know, if you, anything else that you want to know how to do, like I said, all you need to do is DM me on Instagram at Debbie Lane Fletcher. So, if you guys want, like and subscribe and share. I need to get up to 100 subscribers so I can throw a pie in Mark's face. He thinks he's going to get out of it. But I love you guys. Thank you for stopping by. Stay beautiful and stay blessed. I love you.